So, through these examples that I have cited, it's clear that cricketers are not stationary, staid, static entities that just do not exist through space and time. In fact, over the course of their careers, there will be shifts and adjustments as they develop and change and train and experiment. And so the entire idea is that everything is transitory and relative and that people can change depending on the circumstances. And this obsession with detailed, clever, ultra-rational, ultra-scientific analysis of a player trying to exactly work out what they can do and what role they will play in a team is clearly not suitable and it's time for cricket uh, player managers and coaches to realise that they need to go back to the human element of cricket and not obsess over the numbers and the rational details too much that cricket is fundamentally a sport about humans over the course of space and time competing with each other this is not a matter of robots with competing programs.